Hey guys, Pastor Wardell with another children's message today. Question for you, what in your family is the same? There are some things about my family that are always the same. Uh, my nose looks like my dad's nose, and my sister's nose, and my brother's nose. My eyes look a little bit like some of the other people in my family. And even if you don't look like your family, maybe you do some things that are the same as your family. Like when I cook hot dogs on the grill, I do it the same way my dad does. When I cook something else in the kitchen, I might cut it up the same way my mom does. So my question for you is, what is the same about your family? Push pause and answer the question. You know what? Today in church and this week, we are going to talk about how we at Mount Olive are a family growing in Christ. But guess what? Our family is even bigger than our church. It's even bigger than our house. We are in a family with all people who believe in Jesus. And there's something that's the same about us, too. See, there's people who believe in Jesus who cook their hot dogs different from me. And there's people who believe in Jesus who their eyes, ears, their skin looks different from mine. But there is something that's the same about all of us. Here's what it is. All of us have the same big problem. We are sinners. And we do things that are wrong and we think things that are wrong and we say things that hurt people and so we deserve to be punished but we won't be because the second thing that's the same about all of us is that God loves us and God sent Jesus to die on the cross to take away all of our sins but there's one more thing that's the same about us this is what Ephesians chapter 1 says about everybody who believes in Jesus. Ready? It says, When you believed, you were marked in him with a seal, the Holy Spirit. Did you ever go to school with all your own pencils and all your own crayons and all your own markers and all your own book bag and all that stuff? And did mom or dad ever write on there your name? so that nobody would get confused about who it belonged to. Then when you could look at your backpack and you could say, this is my backpack, it's got my name on it. Well, God has done that with you. He has marked you, not with a marker, but with his Holy Spirit. That means that even if you look different from other Christians, even if you sound different from other Christians, even if you cook different from other Christians, you have the Holy Spirit in your heart because God wants to mark you saying, that one belongs to me, and that one over there belongs to me, and everybody who believes in Jesus, God says, you all belong to me. Here's my challenge for you. Can you find some ways to be nice to other people who aren't in your family? Because you are in the big family of Jesus. After we pray, why don't you spend some time thinking with your family how you can be kind to people who believe in Jesus. Ready? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for making us your children. Thank you for marking us with the seal of your Holy Spirit. And thank you for putting us in one big, huge family of people who believe in Jesus. Help us to live out our love for others for your sake. Amen. All right, have fun talking about ways that you can be nice to the great big family of believers.